Hi, I'm Dr. Richard Usatine, Associate Editor of the Journal of Family Practice and Column Editor of Photo Rounds. I am a Professor of Family Medicine, Dermatology, and Cutaneous Surgery at the University of Texas Health Science Center in San Antonio. I am also the Medical Director of the University Skin Clinic. Today we will demonstrate the KOH preparation for diagnosing fungal skin infections. The quickest and most accurate method for diagnosing fungal skin infections is the KOH preparation. While the fungal culture is more sensitive and specific, it can take days to weeks before the diagnosis is known. The first step is to scrape skin from the affected area onto a microscope slide. This can be performed with the edge of a slide, a scalpel, or a curette. Scrape the edge of the lesion to maximize the yield. A sharp skin curette is a very useful tool for scraping subungual keratosis or nails looking for onychomycosis. A cover slip may be used to move the scrapings into the center of the slide before applying KOH. In this case, a fungal stain with KOH is being used. Two drops of the Swartz Lambkin stain will stain the fungal elements blue and begin to dissolve the human cells. A cover slip is placed on the slide and the slide is heated briefly with a flame. Heating with a flame is optional but often speeds up the process of human cell dissolution making it faster and easier to find the fungal elements. Examination of the slide starts at 10 power. The clinician looks for clusters of cells with associated fungal elements such as hyphae or pseudohyphae. While looking for fungal elements, it is important to use the fine focus to search up and down through the specimen, keeping in mind that the preparation is three-dimensional and hyphae may be seen better at one level than another. Once structures suspicious for fungal elements are identified, the objective is switched to 40 power to confirm or dispel the diagnosis. The most common causes of false positives occur when the clinician overreads overlapping cell borders or other artifacts as hyphae, or overreads micelles from topical medicines as yeast forms. The goal is to find fungal elements on high power with definitive fungal morphology, such as septate branching hyphae or pseudohyphae with buds. False negatives occur when the scraping is inadequate or the clinician does not look at sufficient low power fields to screen the slide. See how the fungal stain helps the fungal elements stand out from the human cells and therefore increases the sensitivity of the preparation. These slides at high power show other examples of positive KOH preparations for dermatophyte fungus using swartz lambkin stain. This technique can also be used for tinea versicolor with the result showing Malassezia furfur with a ZD and meatball pattern. It is often difficult to tell the difference between a fungal skin infection, an eczematous eruption, and psoriasis. A properly performed KOH preparation is a powerful tool in the diagnosis of skin diseases.